Welcome to EJM727. This is another one uh, of the series of um, videos that I'm doing on uh, my learning how to use Ustream.tv to uh, be more effective in my broadcast. Today I'm going to discuss the importance of developing your own header. And what that means is it goes, uh, we all know what headers are, it's like Google has a header, Yahoo has a header, even Chris Perillo has a header on his stream. And what I'm talking about is uh, setting one up on yours so, so people, uh, so you're branding, you're actually basically you're branding your site so people know what your site is. And uh, a lot of people use the same logo when they develop their website. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to my desktop and show you what I'm discussing. So if you give me a moment, I will do that. Okay, I'm going to go back to my, sh uh, my show. Actually, let, let's go to somebody else's show. What I'm talking about when I'm talking about branding or putting a header on is we're going to go over to Chris Perillo's site for starters. I have a lot of things up so that's probably the reason why the stream is a little slow today. Alright, as you can see right here, uh, this is Chris's logo. This is his header. This tells you a little bit about his uh, site. Now, let me go to one, another one so you see, see the importance of using branding. Now, this is Jody Gant, and she's a uh, musician who's tr uh, showing people her day to day struggle and how to uh, create. Uh, d develop as a singer and be represented. See how she has a nice clear header. Now at some point you're going to want to develop this on your own show. As you can see here uh, sh she has a nice clear and she has an image of herself and you have a mic here so you have a pretty clear idea of what she's doing. So let's let me show you how how to put one of these up once you develop it, you know, uh, on, on your own, you can either have someone do it, or you can uh, develop it on your own through uh, uh, programs like Photoshop. And I do a presentation on Photoshop, uh, as well as wh when I'm talking about Ustream.tv. Now, in order to uh, put that in, you have to go to the design tab over here. Now let me switch over to the partial so you have a better idea of what I'm talking about. See over here is the design tab. We press that and right under upload background image you'll upload a header image. You click the browse button and uh, since I have mine on a uh, little disk, one of my flash disk, so I'm going to have to go in a little bit. Bear with me while I set this up. All right. What I like is I like to look at the thumbnail so I get to see what I'm looking for so I can look for the right one. Now I have several, and uh, that gives you an. Uh, we're gonna. What I'm going to do is I'm going to let you see what that means. I'm going to pick up here at the moment. Now, if you want to check it out, you hit the uh, preview button, and it'll load and show you what the page is. Now, here's here's my header, and uh, I am not sure whether or not you can see this. 
So, wait a minute. Anyway, this is what how easy it is. Uh, at looking now, let's say you don't want to uh, go with that one. Well, you simply go look for another header in the group. Remember, I like seeing the thumbnail so I know what I'm looking at. And here's another one. This is the one I'm probably going to go with with some changes. But let's take a look and see what it looks like. And, you know, this is something I I like. I, I uh, did a little different. But this is basically how you would set it up. Now the difference is, is I'm going to have to make it a little bit longer here. So it's showing more. And uh, that's what I like about the preview. You can uh, play with it. And then once you're satisfied where it is, you just hit Save Changes. Very important to hit Save Changes, otherwise it won't save what you just did. And basically, that's how you set up a header to brand your show. I'm going to switch back so you can see me. Just bear with me for a moment. Go back to my camera. If you've been watching my show, you know that I'm using a Logitech 9000. I hope you find uh, this useful. Again, I will be uh, branding anything uh, where I'm talking about Ustream.tv, my adventures and learning how to be more effective with my show or my stream, depending on which way you look at it. Um, and uh, you'll be able to, uh, hopefully you'll be able to learn from my mistakes and set yours up faster than uh, I've been able to set up mine. Anyway, I hope you enjoy uh, watching me in my struggles with Ustream.tv and uh, have a good day.